my beloved child, in the whispering winds and the rustling leaves. Hear my voice, calling you to a journey of faith and triumph, from the very genesis of your path. My hand has been clasped in yours, guiding you steadfastly through the darkest valleys and the shadowy realms, even when the world around you ripples with conflict, and your eyes are clouded with the storms of life, remember this. I am the unwavering beacon of hope in your life. This year, a divine promise unfolds before you, laden with blessings, prosperity, and the sweet fruits of recognition and respect. But this path requires not just your footsteps, but your heart's unwavering faith in my eternal word. The word of the one who bore the cross for your ultimate victory. Do not be ensnared by feelings of unworthiness or shadows of doubt, for my love transcends all condemnation. You are chosen, a beacon of hope and a vessel of blessings for your family. Cast aside the chains of defeatism. I am your ally in all endeavors. Draw strength from me daily. Cleanse your thoughts of despair and embrace bravery in your faith. Nourish your soul with my teachings. Let them be the sword and shield in your life's battles. Adorn yourself with the virtues of humility and patience. And watch as the garden of your life blooms with blessings so wondrous. They once seemed beyond the realm of possibility. Embrace your triumphs with simplicity. And clothe them in humility and wisdom. Remember the glory of your victories. The spark of your success, the zeal of your enthusiasm, and the might of your visions were all forged through sacrifice. Through the agonizing blows, the lashes, the bloodshed on the cross. There, on that hallowed ground, your future was written and your forgiveness sealed. Embrace now the grandeur of glory. Born from the power of my resurrection, I vow to be by your side. In moments both prosperous and challenging, to be your watchful guardian, your unwavering provider, your safe haven. Do not harbor thoughts of solitude or abandonment, for you are never alone in my presence. In times of defeat, do not succumb to despair or let negative emotions eclipse your blessings. My words are not idle, they are promises made and kept. In me, defeat has no dominion. Let your heart be a sanctuary of my assurances, for you are held in my steadfast embrace. Reserve in your heart a sacred space for me, here I reside. Reject the whispers of I can't, I lack, I am not, for I am the embodiment of capability, abundance, and existence. Face your adversaries with courage, my child, for I am your constant companion, my provision is abundant, I am the source of your fulfillment. Listen to my guidance, obey and march confidently towards your aspiration. Do not cast your eyes downward, lift your gaze, for I guide you by the hand, shielding you from harm. I am your loyal friend, the one who never falters, never deceives, never wavers, accepting you wholly as you are. I share in your joy and your pain. I celebrate your victories. I support you in triumph. I uplift you in defeat, and I extend my hand when you are in need. I am Jesus. I am your Lord. Behold, I am never present. Fear not, for I am your friend. Do not lose heart or grant your detractors the satisfaction of your downfall. Pursue your path for yourself, for those you love. But most importantly, in remembrance of my boundless love, reflect upon my journey, path of sorrow to a cruel cross, undertaken for you, out of love, for forgiveness, for your liberation, for your healing, for your salvation. Remember in your most challenging moments, I am with you, together hand in hand we will endure. Commit to perseverance, and I assure you my unwavering presence, imbuing you with strength, encouragement, peace, confidence, solace, wisdom, courage, and joy. Open your eyes to the future, to your dreams and desires. They are not mere fantasies. They are seeds I have planted within you. Now expel doubt and disbelief from your heart. Even if you find yourself amid scarcity, uncertainty, and injustice, remember, this path has been tread before. I assure you, in this world you will face trials. But take heart in my triumph, for I have overcome the world. Your heart, brave and steadfast, shall be ignited with the flames of joy and victory. You are a treasure of incomparable worth. Your heart radiates beauty. Your soul exudes purity. And your sincerity mirrors my own image. Feel the profound truth in this. You are a reflection of me, 
a spark of my creation. I breathed life into you. You belong to me. Your intelligence, diligence, and fearless spirit are testaments to your divine inheritance. Your origins, wealth, or lack thereof, the perfection or imperfection of your body, or the flawed perceptions of others. Do not diminish your value in my eyes. You are my beloved child, and I proclaim this loudly for the cosmos to hear. You are an heir to my blessings, enveloped in my boundless love. This is why the enemy views you with trepidation, for they know of my unwavering defense, protection, and provision over you. In my presence you want for nothing. Do not follow the path of those who turned away from me, who listened to their adversaries and believed themselves to be orphans unworthy of love. They chose to forsake me, wandering lost and devoid of peace, comfort, or God. But I stand beside you steadfast. For so long I have urged you to believe in my words. My word is truth, vibrant, powerful, and everlasting, infusing you with faith. It has consistently proven true. I am waiting for you to boldly step forward and claim your courage. Your adversaries are but shadows, fear them not. Their threats, guilt, remorse, and past memories are but feeble and ineffective tools against you. Choose to believe in me. It comes at no cost. You were never fated for failure. My purpose has always been to raise you to great heights, to be a beacon of faith, to lay hands on the sick and despairing, and manifest my power through you. Stand firm in the tempests, wielding the power of my word to topple giants. This is how I envision you, a valiant, unbreakable warrior, embodying holiness and wisdom, humility and heart, a hero of faith, victorious and triumphant. Embrace and declare this inherent worth within yourself. You are my cherished child, my beloved, my love. For you is everlasting, and ending. Confide in me. Express your belief and love for me. I yearn to hear it. Let your voice carry these truths. Your importance to me is immeasurable, and it is my deepest wish for you to feel profoundly loved. Yet I see times when you wake engulfed in sorrow. So deep that its cause eludes even you, it's an emotion that appears abruptly. As if your heart is striving to communicate something vital, understand this, for it is essential. That feeling is your heart resonating with my Holy Spirit. In the quiet of the morning, my spirit whispers your name, beckoning you back when you start to drift away, but often, you're so entangled in the day's demands that you miss these moments to sit and recall my presence, and my spirit gently warns you, cautioning against the emptiness that's creeping in. The sadness you experience is a fervent plea from your soul, your spirit, your heart, all crying out in thirst, longing for the living water that heals, replenishes, and sweeps away the turmoil, restoring peace and serenity to your emotions if you find yourself feeling desolate, parched within. It's a sign that you've been away from my presence for too long. This cannot continue. If this persists, your emotions will start to muddle. In times of challenge, instead of facing your trials with faith, these confused feelings might deceive you into believing. I'm punishing you for unkept promises or that I've forsaken you, but that is not my nature. I am not one to lie or deceive. My love for you has been demonstrated in countless ways. Draw near to me and I will fill your being with divine sweetness. I will nourish you, envelop you in love so profound that your tears will be ones of joy. No matter where you are, you will not be overwhelmed by despair. Should tears come and others inquire, you will speak the truth. I am enveloped in the magnificent love of my Father, who speaks to me in a tender heavenly language with words of wonder and sincerity, affirming his immense love for me and kindling an everlasting flame in my heart. My sorrow has vanished. My Father has dispelled all my despair and granted me a new life. I wish to help you. I will heal you. It is my desire to bless you, my will to aid and save you. Read my word, believe it, and place your trust within it. Stand unwavering in the days ahead. For I am posed to manifest miracles and wonders in your life and within your family. Time and again I have spoken to you. Laying out plans of prosperity and hope for you and your loved ones. Expect remarkable blessings in a brighter future. My declarations are set. They are inscribed in eternity. I will fulfill them. I will bring them to fruition. Embrace peace and joy, should you choose to believe in me. 
Rest in the certainty of my word and free yourself from anxieties about what lies ahead. Do not let negative thoughts besiege your mind. Worry is a thief of happiness, a blinder of vision, a drainer of energy, and a fog over your spiritual clarity.